I'm here at Nelson's Market in the South Valley and you can see that this line is stretched out the door. Now part of that is because of social distancing, but the owner says that business has been overwhelming and while they're not seeing a shortage of meat yet, they may in the future. Nelson's Meats is busier than ever. We have probably a hundred or more orders every day over the phone. And that doesn't include the customers walking in. We're having a hard time keeping up and uh, we're overwhelmed with business right now. Big companies like Tyson now warning that there could be a meat shortage in the U.S. because of staffing issues and COVID-19 cases rising amongst employees. Are you guys going to be affected by that shortage? Well, we haven't been. They're uh, shorting some of the order, but not some of the meat. The co-owner of the shop, Larry Nelson, says they do get some of their supply from Tyson. And if the shortage does reach them... We'll have to limit product. In other words, you won't be able to buy 20 pounds of hamburger. You might be able to buy five or 10 at a time. Larry says many New Mexicans are also overstocking on meats. If they would just, people would just keep from hoarding because eventually when all this uh, virus is over, there's going to be a lot of meat. For Nelson's Meats, it will continue doing what it can to keep business going. Hopefully we have enough product bought for uh, two or three weeks that so we can probably take care of the customers. The owner also told me that they do have a few ranches, so that will definitely help them sustain business here. Reporting in Albuquerque, Marissa Armas, KOAT Action 7 News.